So I spoke about AML post MDS and the most important theme of the uh, of my talk was that it's not like you're changing a disease when you transform from MDS to AML. You actually AML that develop emerge from AM, of MDS is really some kind of high risk MDS more like it's more related to high risk MDS than to the novo AML. So what I'm challenging is the word transformation when you speak about the uh, moving from MDS to AML. What I show in my talk is that there is no Rubicon that you are crossing. It's like a deterioration of your MDS until you reach to a point that according to our current um, definition is called AML, but it's really, really not like de novo AML. It's disease that should be addressed not only by killing or eradicating the blast that's proliferating like you do in the novo AML, but also must be addressed, the underlying MDS must be addressed, and this require additional uh, treatment and additional approach that must be considered. And it's not like you move from MDS to AML and now in a specific uh, or regular AML approach will be enough.